skincare routine you'll actually follow through with. Let's start off strong by saying that I have combination skin and I have sensitive skin and I mean super uber uber sensitive skin. Starting off will be the Caudalie Missler water. I think I've purchased like 15 bottles and I actually have two in my house. I like to keep one in the shower and then I have another one that's like where I keep my little cosmetics and that's where I do my morning routine. Yes a little bougie but I love it so much plus having two just keeps me in check that way I don't run out. It works so so well. Then I'll go in and double cleanse with the Toradin Dive and Cleansing Foam. This one is clean ingredients. So amazing. If you could get your hands on this one, I would say yes, try it. Get your hands on it. It will not disappoint you. Kind of sad because I'm running out of it and I won't be repurchasing it only because I have a lot of PR. The PR that I receive is things that I genuinely want to try because it's things that I would buy. So I'm just going to try something from the PR, you know, not hurt the bank by buying more stuff, but just using what I have. Moving on, I will follow up with a rice toner. This is K Beauty's favorite, favorite, favorite thing. Rice toner just helps balance everything out. I have seen an improvement with my redness. So I deal with a lot of redness in my cheek. Right now I have nothing on my skin. This is just what my skin looks like. And I feel like although you can see a little bit of redness, it's a lot better than when it used to be before. And I feel like the rice toner has helped with that. And I have two, actually three, but one's in my bathroom. So we're just going to stick with two. I have my all-time favorite moisturizer. This one I like to wear during the day. The La Roche-Posay Double Repair Face Moisturizer. It is amazing. It's so simple too. It doesn't have like these tons of like fancy stuff in it. It just, this is like going back to the basics and just letting your skin heal. And then at night, I will go in with the Midnight Milk this is the one that i talk about it's the better aging sleep cream but i call it the princess cream because i feel like what i mean is i wake up and i feel like i have this instant glow it just does its magic at night this one has Bakuchino, which Bakuchino is a retinol alternative. So if you have sensitive skin, this would be a great option for you to start kind of like steps into retinol. Bakuchio peptide and melatonin is what this one has. And this one, I love it so much. I've been using it for, I think, like a month and it hasn't really gone down much because you use the small... Oh, ah, okay. Stay in there because I don't need you. It's daytime. But you can see it just comes off and then you just come... I'm sad because not this is just waste. Maybe I should, let me just come back. I'm gonna close it because I feel like it's just gonna keep wasting. One thing I forgot to mention is the facial oil, and I didn't mention it because I'm out of it. But luckily, I was sent some PR with this exact bottle, so I was like, yes, like I love it already. This one gives you the best, best, best glow of your face. So before I put on the moisturizer, I will put on the glow oil. So this would be more like a day routine. But what I want to start doing for nighttime is before I put on the moisturizer. I want to start putting this nice into my 10% TXA 4% by Anua. Like you can see, I have not used it. I purchased this myself. This was not PR, but I'm just so excited to try it because I just, sometimes you get breakouts like over here. You can see these little dots. I feel like this right here will wash that away and clear it out so that you can't see those dark spots. So how I'll rotate it is I use this one during the day and I use this one during the night. But I like to kind of rotate products if I have them. I did bring the other moisturizer recommendation that I have is Dear Claire's. This one I feel like did help with my redness. It's almost gone but I kind of rotated between these two until I got this one and I was like oh, this one's too good and I need to use it right away. Eye cream, this one's very, very new. This is the Mushroom Milk Better Aging Eye Cream. It's got amazing reviews and it just takes a little bit, a little bit, a little. You just put it on your eye. I'm excited to see this one. This says five years younger in five days. We shall see. I'm actually going to do an update on this one. So we will see. And lastly, if it's during the day, we have to apply sunscreen. So this is my all time, all time favorite. I'm almost out, but no worries because I think I have like three more in my drawer because I just keep them stocked up. The Centella Hyalu Sika Water Fit Sun Serum. I love the consistency of it. I even use it on my daughter. Consistency is like not watery but it's like a, this silky consistency and it goes on beautifully under makeup. It just feels like naked skin, breathable. It's just absolutely amazing. With all that being said, I always get compliments on my skin. Thank you so much. But I will have to say, you don't need all of these products. I don't know how. If I had to guess how much money is all of these products, I would have to say maybe three, $400. You don't need all of that. If you want to simplify your skincare routine to the basics, I know this economy is kind of crazy. Say you definitely need 
micellar water, your first base of getting all that gunk out from the day. Even when you sleep, you still have gunk. Face wash, you want this face wash that's super gentle, but it's your double cleansing. So you're making sure that your skin is super, super, you know, clean. Moisturizer, moisturize your skin. You don't want it to dry out. Even if you're oily, you still want to moisturize it because I feel like if it's oil, if you're oily and you don't moisturize it because you think you're oily, then it's just going to combat. It's going to bump heads and you're going to end up breaking out. Of course, sunscreen, 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 sunscreen. So if you're on a budget, but you want to kind of change your skincare routine, these are the four products that I would say you absolutely could start your routine with and start to see a difference. Now, remember it's about consistency and just making sure that you're doing this every single day the bonus if you're like okay i got these four like what else do you think would be a really good option if you want to splurge a little bit more then i would say midnight milk because this one is doing like five different things so if you get this one then you're avoiding getting five other products just because of all the good stuff that this one will do to so the bare minimum i would say these are the products that i would recommend for your full skincare routine to begin with i hope that helps please stick around go ahead and subscribe go ahead and follow because i will be talking about these things even more i always put little nuggets of products that i'm trying or just things that i'm changing up when i receive pr it's pr that i've vetted is stuff that i've read the reviews is something that i would normally buy with my own money I do get free stuff is because i truly believe in this product thank you so much and i will see you in the next one